In order to use Mendeley to search for a scale, what you need to do is you need to first put in your papers. Let's say I'm searching for servant leadership and different scales. So, and I've got 200, 300 papers on servant leadership. Let's add them. Here are all the papers. So select all. Press open. Now importing file 3, 4 or whatever number is of 383. So it might take some time to import all the files. Now that all the papers are added to Mendeley on this particular folder here, let's say I'm interested in searching for scale on servant leadership. Servant leadership. So here are the papers on servant leadership out of 383 papers. 214 are on servant leadership. But going through all these papers is not an easy job. So what I'll do is I'll use and and then I will use let's say measure. So exploring servant leadership across culture. Here it is. Let's say conceptualization and measurement. So here is a paper on servant leadership and that discusses the measure of servant leadership as well. Now there could be others as well. Look at these highlighted texts here. Measure of shared servant leadership. Look at the title of the papers. Servant leadership validation of short form of SL28. Let's open this one here. So where is my questionnaire? Here it is in the table. These seven items are measuring servant leadership. Similarly, you can open other papers and have a look at those as well. Let's say I open this paper here. Now when you open it, look at this. It's saying there is no match for the phrase because now it's taking this whole as a phrase. But we know that we have to get to the methodology section and look at the methodology section to see the scale. Here it is. Servant leadership scores. And there were 30 servant leadership statements. But is there a source? Well, they haven't mentioned the scale they have used. There's no source for it. Here are the servant leadership factors. Now they are using this particular reference, eight factors. So they haven't mentioned the source and it doesn't look like they developed the scale on their own. So there's a bit of lack of clarity pertinent to the questionnaire they have used. There are no items as well. So I guess for now we should avoid a such scale. And we can look into others as well. Let's say this one here. Let's go down to methodology. Here it is. And operationalization of study variables. So servant leadership was assessed with a multi-dimensional measure that was developed and validated by Lidden. So they used the Lidden scale. And this was the Likert scale they used, 28 items. Now again, go to the Lidden scale instead of looking at the questionnaire they have provided. Go to the original source. Where is Lidden? Here it is. Lidden et al. Development of multidimensional measure. Just copy this text into Google Scholar and you will have the paper as well. Let's have a look. Let's copy it. Put it in Google Scholar. Now here it is. Let's open it. View PDF. Now this is the paper and where is the scale? Here is your scale. Here are the items and this is EFA. So they might have removed items after EFA. So is there a finalized scale? No, there is no finalized scale. So, so to extract the scale, you might have to read the paper a bit. So how many items? 28 items. So this is the final scale. So how do I select? Okay, so where are the items of emotional healing? Look at this. Look at the loading 0.61. This is higher here. In comparison to all these loadings, this is high. So this is emotional healing. This is emotional healing as well. This, this. Now look at this. This is not emotional healing. This item here is not related to emotional healing. It is creating value for the community. Look at this, the loading 0.86. Again, all this. So this is the third one here. Now this is the fourth one. So they have arranged it in order. So wherever the loading is high, that particular item or statement belongs to that particular factor. So this is how you can divide these items here into these factors. Let's say I'm searching for another question here. Let's say 
organizational identity. So I've got the papers. Let's put it in quotes. So it's not searching it. Let's remove the quotes. Here it is. So is organizational identity a variable in this study? Well, it doesn't look like it. So what you need to do is look at the model. And if it is in the model, this is a variable. Again, go to the research methodology and find out the source. So once you've downloaded the paper, you just need to put in the text for that particular variable in the search box here and open the paper, go to its methodology and find out the questionnaire. So this is how you can use Mendeley to search for your questionnaire. Thank you very much.